Hi, my name is Juan Castro and I'm currently a pre-law student majoring in business administration here at UT Dallas. I'm set to graduate in summer 2023. I'm also the vice president for the Society of Human Resource Management, so um, SHRM at UT Dallas, and I'm also a member of the Tau Sigma National Honor Society. Like many of you, I'm also a first generation college student. Obviously, being one of the first in your family to get an education, you have no idea what you're expecting. Um, college is extremely different from high school, from middle school, from elementary. But I've learned so many valuable skills here at UT Dallas from time management, networking, presenting. Um, it's, it's all been extremely helpful for my career and my future prospects. My parents, being both immigrants, worked hard most of their lives so they can uh, support a family of seven. Day in and day out, they will work so that they can give us, so that they can give me the best possible future. And I've been grateful ever since. If there's one thing that I've learned from my parents is that no one is going to do the work for you. You have to take charge. You have to be determined. And to do that, you have to take the initiative in your own life. And that's the single most important thing I brought with me to college, my initiative. It's helped me maintain a professional relationship with my professors and peers. It's helped me maintain a high GPA. And it's essentially what's driving my day-to-day -day activities. I recall when I was just a member for the Society of Human Resource Management at UT Dallas, so SHRM UTD, um, officer morale was low and member participation was even lower. So when they elected me vice president, I decided to ramp up marketing and I did that by creating a SHRM promo to show what it really means to be a part of our club. I'm also in the process of making business cards um, and that's really to target HR majors and minors in our program at JSOM and, to, and basically anyone else who's interested in human resource management. Now, member participation is at an all-time high. HR majors and minors have joined us and even psych majors have joined us and I'm just grateful for every single opportunity I get to spend time with them. Like many of my peers, I come from a working class family. They are my motivation and I do all of this for them. The university has given me so many opportunities and resources that now I'm ready to give back by serving. Service to me means raising awareness. It's an opportunity to engage with the community, especially the UTD community. You can raise so much awareness about whatever service you're passionate about and receive an enormous amount of support from the student body. Service to me also means connecting. I mean, with this year being our first year back in person, um, service has given me a chance to make lasting friendships with people that share the same passions as I do. Whether I volunteer at Feed My Starving Children, why I help pack food and send it to kids in need all over the world, to even helping make no soul blankets for homeless shelters to help those in poverty combat the harsh winter months. All these endeavors have helped me create lasting friendships and given me enormous amount of experience in becoming a better student leader. And I'm ready to serve. Now that financial matters at home are better than they were at the start of the pandemic, I can have more time to focus and engage with my organizations and within the UTD community, or really within any community, because that's what service is. It brings out the best in people. I remember in 2008 when both my parents lost their jobs. Um, money was extremely tight and my parents worried 24 seven. I didn't know it at the time, but the recession did hit us pretty hard. But there was a silver lining in all of this. Every Tuesdays and Thursdays, I would go with my parents to the Highlands Oak Church um, and we would go to their food pantry and we would pick up boxes of donated food that would maintain us, that would basically feed us for the time being. And um, I'm extremely thankful for all those volunteers that helped us during those times. Um, I will never forget them because their act of kindness really kept us going as a family. And But that's what it means to serve, um, to engage, to help make your community better. And that's all it takes, one selfless act of kindness to make a community great. I hope this video has given you a greater insight into who I am, what I'm capable of, and what I'm willing to do for the university. And once again, I thank the Student Ambassador Program for giving me the opportunity to prove my worth. Thank you so much.